Good morning, my dear students. I'm Mr. Samuel Adelaja. I hope you are ready for my class this morning. Get your writing materials. Get yourself ready. Be seated. Thank you. The topic we shall be considering this morning is political participation. Political participation. And then what you are expected to know at the end of this lesson, under the lesson objectives, one, you should be able to define political participation. You should be able to identify forms of political participation. And lastly, you should be able to describe purposes of political participation. Having said that, let's go straight to the meaning of political participation. What is political participation? I believe some of you, you have heard, maybe you have not attained the age of uh, 48 yet, but you must have seen people, you know, participating in voting processes. So, in the same vein, we want to look at the meaning of political participation. What is the meaning of political participation? This is defined as the process whereby individuals get themselves involved in the political activities and in the decision making of their country. That is to say, if you are participating in the political process of your country, you are also taking part in the decision making of your country. What are the forms of political participation? Forms of political participation. Individuals' political participation may take the following forms. Number one, voting in elections. Voting in elections. When you are voting in elections, it will give you the choice of uh, choosing your desired candidate. It means that when you are voting in an election, is one of the way of one of the ways of political participation which gives the individual the opportunity to vote for candidate of his choice. Another form. Holding of public offices. When someone is holding any public office, this allows the individual to contribute immensely, immensely in the areas of decision making and in other crucial issues of national importance. Another one, contesting elections. Contesting elections. When an individual stands as a candidate, as a candidate on the platform of his party for an elective post, such person participates in politics. You can see our Politicians, when the election is coming, you see them, see posters around. The one, all of them will be contested from one post or the other. So that's another form of political participation. Another one, when you are supporting political parties, some people they are very wealthy and influential. So and they have more interest in partisan politics. So by so doing, they can sponsor or support a political party. By so doing, they are also 
participating in the political participation of their country. Another one is uh, belonging to a political party. This involves individuals active and direct involvement in the political terrain of his country. He participates in campaigns, congresses, to mention but a few. So when you belong to a political party, this will give you the chance to, you know, get yourself involved in active and political uh, terrain of your country. Another one is uh, supporting candidates for elected posts. This could take the form of a moral or financial support. Some people, they are not contesting. In fact, they don't have interest in holding any public office, but they can support a candidate of their choice, morally and financially, to make sure that the person gets to that post. That's another form of a political participation. Another one is a protest and demonstration. Protests and demonstration. When citizens demonstrate or protest against any policy of the government, the individuals are involved in political participation. When people are protesting or demonstrating about any policy, any policy made by the government that is not okay by them, that's another form of a political participation. But that will take form of a, a you know, a, a peaceful demonstration, not a violent one. Another one is a partial political participation. Partial political participation. By attending partially some of the political activities, e.g. campaigns, rallies, etc. So some people, they are not participating fully, but partially when they attend some political some of the political activities they are also participating in the political participation of their country and the last one observatory political participation observatory political participation what happens under this is that the individual is only an observer and takes delight in no, or interest in listening to political talks, discussions, debates, etc. Like some people, they love to watch and listen to uh, uh, Political Today on Shannon's television, anchored by Shane Okimbaloye. Some people, when they follow that kind of program, you know, and develop interest, they are also, eh? participating but their own is being referred to as a of surfeitry political participation now let's now look at the purposes of political participation purposes of political participation that is the motives behind political participation the reason behind number one decision making decision making some people participate in politics in order to contribute their quota in the decision making process of their country some people they want to get themselves involved because they feel that they feel like contributing their own quota you know in the decision making process of their country so they, they, some people feel that uh, let me also put my own contribution. That's why some people are going to politics. Another one is a uh, failure, failure of past governments, failure of past government. Some people take part in politics because past governments have failed the people, especially in the areas of provision of amenities, e.g., water, electricity, housing, and good roads, because. When they read their manifesto to us, they will promise even a head that they will do they will do that. By the end of the day, by the time they will they they they, 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 they will finish their tenure of office, you won't see all these things, all those things being done. 
So many people will feel like, okay, if I can be part of this, I will correct those uh, failures of the past government. Another one is uh, another purpose of political participation. Correction of the ills in the society. Correction of the ills in the society. That's the, the third one. The idea of some people coming to the political system is to correct some, some of the ills in the society. For example, bribery and corruption, tribalism and drug pushing. So they have seen this and they feel that if I can be part of this eh, system, I will correct all these eh, ills. That's why they are going to politics. Fourth one, affirming for money making. To some people, affirming for money making. To some people, the essence of political participation is money making and other gains associated with it. Some people believe that going to politics, if they can get one office, they will use it as an avenue to amass the, uh, the wealth of the country, of the nation to themselves. That's why they want to go into politics. Another one, fifth one, for respect and prestige. Some individuals participate in politics because they want to acquire respect. They want to acquire respect and prestige in life. The respect that follows those politicians, they want to have it as well. That's why they want to go into politics. Another one, as occupation. Some individuals could claim that politics is the occupation they have chosen and so their active participation in the fulfillment of their political career. So they, they, that why you, that's why when you ask them, what are they for a living? What is occupation? They will tell you, I am a politician. So they have seen it as what? As a, as an occupation. Another one is management of the nation's resources. Management of nation's resources. As we all know, there is no nation in the world, no country in this world that doesn't have mineral resources, human resources, but if a reasonable government can handle this together, it will be a good thing for what people of that country. So some people, some individuals with enough resources and skill take part in politics because they want to be involved in managing equitably the nation's economic resources so that it will go around, not like eh, those that will just be amassing those to themselves. So that's why some people they want to be part of the political activities of their country. Now, in conclusion, in conclusion, the essence of this lesson is to let the learners know that they must be actively involved in the electoral activities of their country. How do I mean? That is, as a student, what you have learned under this topic is for you to get yourself ready to be actively involved in the electoral activities of your country. All the politicians that you see around, some of them, the they started from their grassroots political system. Some have been taking part in the community uh, development of their area. Some, they will start from their local government before they will proceed to what? To the state. And before you can be talking about the national uh, political activities. So, it is very, very important for you to note this, that uh, you too, you should be aspiring to be part of the political activities of your country. Even in your academic environment, that is, in your school, that's why in Greenland Hall, you normally showcase prefectship 
election. Just to train you and to prepare you for what you will meet in the future. You must see it as if as very essential to serve in order to contribute your own quota in the development of the school. That's why if the prefectship election is coming, some students will show their interest by obtaining the form and we will put them through screening. Under that screening, we want to hear from you what you intend to do for the school. How do you think if you are given that particular post, if you are given that chance, you can turn things around positively for the school? You want to know you as a person. At the same time, we want to hear from you what you understand by that post you are fighting for. So, if you can take part in this, it will give you the opportunity to contribute your own quarter in the development of the school. By so doing, it will have become part of you to see the need to serve in your community and in the country and the country at large. So if you allow this to be part of you, now maybe you are the uh, senior boy or senior girl, head prefect, utilities prefect, like that, it will have been part of you so that by the time you get outside here, it won't be a new thing to you. So opportunity may call on you just to do what? To contribute your own quota. So since it has been part of you, you will be able to, you, uh, the idea is already there for you. And at the same time, you'll be able to perform. You have the passion just to turn around things in your locality, in your environment, and uh, by so doing, you proceed to the state and at the same time to the national uh, level. So, the essence of this lesson is to let the learners know that uh, they must be actively involved in the electoral activities of their country. Even in their academic environment, they must see it as very essential to serve in order to contribute their own quota in the development of the school. By so doing, it will have become part of them. By so doing, it will have become the part of them to see the need to serve in their communities and the country at large. Now, the assignment. Assignment under this topic, you are to answer two questions. The first question goes thus, what do you understand by political participation? What do you understand by political participation? So, in your own view, what do you understand by political participation? Second question, how do you participate in the political activities of your country? How do you participate in the political activities of your country? These are the two questions at the, uh, 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 for your assignment. And uh, I am expecting you to submit them when you are coming for the next class. Thank you for listening. God bless you.